In my previous video, I was installed macOS Ventura on a unsupported Mac MacBook Air 2015 model. But I think at this moment it is not properly ready for this macOS Ventura. I faced some display driver issues, slow running, booting issues. So at this moment it is not suggested to install macOS Ventura on a unsupported Mac. I used OpenCore Legacy Patcher for the installation. I will update here when it will ready. In this video we will see how to go back to official macOS version. Let's see. I found this error when booting. I tried with NVRAM and SMC reset. Still facing same issues. Now turn off the Mac and press and hold Command R then power button once to turn on. Release Command R when I see the globe icon. Then connect Wi-Fi to starting internet recovery. Select language Then Dix utility from utility window and selecting this and format it. Now go back to utilities window and going for reinstall OS X. After some time, I got this famous certificate error. We can easily fix it with date command. Open terminal from utility. Then type date. Then months date. And time. Then last year. Close terminal. I reinstall macOS. Now we can see that certificate error is fixed. And select Macintosh HD and install. It takes lots of time after some time something strange happen. I have seen something like this due to open core legacy feature. Maybe, maybe I have to format the Apple SSD partition also from the Dix utility. But I got an error when I was formatting it. Now restart Mac and press and hold command R again selecting network and going to internet recovery. Surprisingly now it is opening macOS Monterey internal recovery. Going to Dix utility again then I got actual Dix utility window. Select Apple SSD then erase it. Finally, it erased successfully and close it. Then I continue to reinstall macOS Monterey. And I did not notice that somehow Wi-Fi is disconnected. So connect again to continue. Now this is feel like my Mac will getting on again.
after selecting Macintosh HD and continue, progress bar is suddenly increased to this point and it takes around 2 hours to complete. Now it restart and takes 20 minutes again. After all those steps, finally got this window to creating user accounts and now it is login successfully. So guys don't try macOS Ventura now on unsupported Mac. Open Core Legacy Patcher is working perfectly on macOS Monterey. If you have unsupported Mac for macOS Monterey, you can you can try, but not macOS Ventura at this moment. I don't know how you like it. Please comment below if anything you want to cover here. Please help me with subscribe and also click on bell icon to get notification. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.